In this lesson, we will show you how to create an intersecting roof, and we're going to do this um, twice. We're going to do it once as one roof, and then we'll do it another time with two separate roofs and using our join roofs tool. So again, I'm, uh, I've got some walls. These walls are going from level one up to level two. My current level here is level two. Here's my 3D view. So again, I can start my roof tool, home, roof by footprint again. Okay, I'm going to, oh, I don't need to save this right now. And I'm going to set my overhang, you know, back to be maybe, uh, let's say, 20 inches. Okay, and then I'm going to click in here to make this view current. Once again, making sure I'm on level two. Hover over here, tab to pick all these, and click. Okay, now all of these, this is going to make uh, hip edges all the way around. Now I can hit escape, escape on the keyboard. What I need to do is take these guys and take the slope off which will make that a gable. Okay, And then take this guy off, take the slope off of that, that makes that a gable. So sloping, sloping, slope, 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 slope. Okay, This one belongs to this guy. So what is the slope going to be? I can set my slope off here and or I can just go back and say finish roof. Finish my roof, click out here, SD on the keyboard Okay, and now I can pick on this one wall, go up to my modify walls and say attach to this roof and that one's done. Zoom over here to the other side, pick this wall, gable end, up to here, attach to here, click out, escape. Okay, and I can just maximize that view there. And there is the um, joined intersecting roof, gable and hip. Okay, we'll come back in our next lesson. We'll do the same thing, but we'll use two separate pieces of roof.